all sort of new to me. I think I might have played at this stadium here, but even then I don't remember walking around the neighborhoods. It's manic and it's big. Just going from one building to the next has been a little hectic. <laughs> and do they really believe it's you? Or you well, that's what the guy just said. He goes, oh, he's real. <laughs> Not it's very, very surreal, this whole thing, yeah. I'm a big horror fan ever since I was a kid. It's based in Stull, Kansas, which is a real place. And it's got this sort of dark mythology about it, which says that it's literally one of the seven gateways to hell. And so it has this stigma. <laughs> I was just looking for a town called Stull. You wouldn't be the new pastor, would you? Uh, actually, yes. How'd you know that? The pastor invites another pastor and his family to relocate to Stahl. Pastor Kingman asked me to keep an eye out for you. That move turns out to be a front for a more sinister and dark plan, and it all goes horribly wrong for the family at that point. This place is evil. Ah, Horror movies are my biggest inner geek thing, but then I suppose probably the embarrassing thing would probably be the amount of cartoons that I watch. You know, anywhere from Adventure Time to the regular show, to SpongeBob. With or without nuts. Phineas and Ferb. Ferb. Someone posted a picture of somebody that looked identical to me. I'm assuming it was last year, because this was at 10 o'clock in the morning. I would hate to think that he was down here that early. It just would have been bad character. <laughs> he had the whole thing going on. I guess it's the top hat. That, that's the key thing, that, you know. You have to get a good leather top hat. Great. And a guitar. <laughs> yeah. to, to that? Yeah. To this guy. Uh, uh, hey, I'm Slash. Thanks, Hollywood Reporter, for having me down here at Comic-Con. <laughs> Remember we got Rob in the Toronto Wait. <laughs>